Wrestling fans, we're back at it today with the WWE Mattel Elite Legends Series 16, The Acolytes, Bradshaw and Farouk. The Undertaker formed the Ministry of Darkness. And in that group, he had a tag team of Bradshaw and Farouk. They were named the Acolytes. The muscle behind the Ministry of Darkness. The Acolytes won two World Tag Team Championship reigns as a member of the Ministry. They did go on and win the WWE World Tag Team titles as APA, which stands for Acolytes Protection Agency. This was pre-APA. There have been APA Bradshaw and Farouk figures made, but this is the first Acolytes tag team ever made. Awesome figure here. You've got Farouk, also known as Ron Simmons, and Bradshaw, of course, JBL, both becoming World Heavyweight Champions. Ron Simmons, WCW World Heavyweight Champion. Bradshaw going on to win the WWE World Heavyweight Champion. Two Hall of Famers, two awesome dudes, acolytes, two awesome figures here. So let's get into it and check these guys out and see what they look like out of the box. Pretty cool box though, okay? Love the Legends boxes. This series also featured Molly Holly and Rey Mysterio. So there's the box for you. Let's get into it. Let's get it going. Let's open up Farouk first here. Farouk. Farouk. Pretty easy to get into these Mattel Elites. I mean, just like that. We got the root. And of course, both figures coming with that WWE Classic World Tag Team Championship. So, if you're looking to make a Ministry of Darkness set, these are must have, okay? must-have figures. Comes with an extra set of tape hands. And he's free. Keep my shells, old shells, in good condition. Um, you keep them looking good. You can put your figures back in for display purposes. Um, so there you have Farouk. Ron Simmons. One half of the Acolytes. Now let's get his tag team partner, Bradshaw. Let's get Bradshaw opened up. You know, when I was looking over some of the material to do this video, I was a little surprised that APA only held the tag team titles one time because as popular as they were, um, you know, the Acolytes actually held the little tag team titles more than the APA. So that's kind of an interesting tidbit there. So here you have to root. Not a ton of accessories. You do get those classic World Tag Team titles, which are hard to come by. And there we have a little bit of wear on that figure, or some paint, black paint smudge. So to all those people that buy figures from me, I sell, of course, on eBay, um, check out the store. You know, I've opened new figures. You can see the arm there has some black smudge on it. Probably from the paint um, right here has just smudged down in here, or paint from the elbow pad, I don't know which. Um, I've tried to tell people before I've opened figures new out of box and you know, they're, that doesn't make them mint condition. So I don't always like to label things as mint condition or near mint or whatever, but there you have 
the acolytes. There is the acolyte symbol on the side. Um, these awesome World Tag Team Championship belts. Colored. You know, the classic Superstars line had the awesome classic tag team titles, but they weren't colored. These look fantastic. And an awesome set there. So there you have the Acolytes, Farouk and Bradshaw. Subscribe to our channel for more toy reviews and give this video a big thumbs up.